So if your temperature and pressure relief valve leaks, which comes out of here intermittently and wets your floor, it's a good idea to check if you have check valves on the system. What effectively this does, and particularly the cold, is that it prevents water from backing up and relieving pressure. When a hot water tank heats up the cold water, thermal expansion ends up causing the water to expand and ultimately go to a pressure high enough to likely trip your temperature pressure relief valve. So in order to remedy that, we can install an expansion tank. And we also added a valve here for servicing. The important thing about installing an expansion tank is to make sure that it's installed downstream and after the check valve. Because installing it before the check valve is going to prove redundant and it's going to do no good for your system. So now whenever the cold water expands when heated, the expansion of the water will press against that air bladder and will regulate and maintain pressure without overloading the temperature pressure relief valve.